Hello everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Masters. In the last one, we met Skylar, who seems like a very, very sweet lassie, very optimistic, which is nice. And then we quote-unquote battle Lear, which was not really a battle, we didn't actually have any saying it. And he kind of irks me at the moment. I hope he has a, char a character development throughout the game. Maybe a little bit, that would be nice. So he's a little tiny bit more likable. However, it was suggested that we were going to relax because we might be exhausted after the battle and go and just chill with Skylar before we battle her. But the next part of this chapter is that we actually go right back into battles. That's no tea, that's no cafe relaxation that's more battles <laughs> oh well uh, <laughs> well <laughs> that, that's actually hmm, interesting anyway let's just jump into it and see what we will be battling predominantly we predominantly be battling rock okay um, I think I should always switch these two around not that I would change anything about what I'm having right now I would just like to have Roak in the front, because you also get the end screens where they say stuff, which is really nice. And yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's because he's uh, he has the fist emblem, which I don't still don't know what those small emblems next to the heads over here. Oh, I can't actually click on it. Um, where is it on his screen? It actually isn't on his screen. No, oh, yeah. His role. Uh, dear, he is in his flu glory. Apparently, you can't click on anything here without taking you to a next area <laughs> of everything. Um, but his role is kind of like a bro fist, as you can see. Over here. That's probably the closest I can click on it before it actually. Yeah, before he went into it. So he has like a bro fist, so I'm guessing he's focused on strength. Um. I don't know, so I'm guessing he would be a good team leader, maybe? Anywho, let's jump right into it and battle some more people while we try to relax. Maybe that's what our relaxation is, to beat some randos and just feel good about ourselves. <laughs> Who knows? Aren't the mountains great? Aww, he's nice. The air is clean and the waters are crystal clear. Yeah, not how the situation of the world is going. It probably won't stay that way. And the Pokemon battles are hot, right? Yeah. I don't know. Are we near the lava mountain? Magma mountain? Are we anywhere near there? I don't think so. So let's see here. So we have two youngsters, one camper and one hiker. And we have, of course, uh, let's take out the grass. Grassy gas one right away because that definitely is going to take the most of the energy. Really? Really? Okay, one more then. She's not strong enough to give them more problems. I don't know. So, and then we will have do some smackdown with Roak. Oh man, they just barely destroyed them. Just barely. Which is slightly annoying. <laughs> Let's see. And the hiker has a... Oh, okay. Um, time to energize them. I wonder how scattered battles my, my battle talk is. Because uh, it, it's quite um, all over the place because I'm concentrating on the battle at hand. And you definitely need a double one. I'm glad I have two rock type Pokemon because they will not be that much affected by that attack. And then we have this guy and we have Roark do that. Yes. There we are. We did well. <laughs> Somewhat. Uh, man. Even though getting a relaxing cup of tea, I'm still kind of like, how can this kid be as he is? But and sadly, that's how the world is. Some people aren't like that. Perceiving stuff to be the world is centered around them and they need to get there. Uh, yeah, and that's just how the world is. Some in the world are, sadly. Oh man. 
Okay. My strength is fragile. And... Uh, no, you did a good... You, you did a good battle, man. Like, all y your comrades' Pokémon did not die in one-hit kills. Which is fascinating, in my opinion. Because I expected it to be like that. I guess I still have ways to go. Yes, get back on the horsey. <laughs> You're not a water type Pokemon trainer, never mind. Get back on your... Mm... Onyx and ride on. Yes, there we are. <laughs> I was thinking of another Pokemon and couldn't remember the name. Brr. Oh, we have another ranger. And there's... There was a Beedrill over there. Yes. Will you be able to face the majesty of nature? Oh, that's how they actually talk. I just thought the one in the previous one was just being weird with the... With the, I'm gonna bite you type. <laughs> but no, the, all the rangers are like that. Great! That's good! But they're also rangers, which gives... Pokemon what, that actually kind of makes sense. And then we have some ace trainers as well. I think they are ace trainers, or were they... Tra I think they were ace trainers. Anywho, let's start out with actually taking out the Sun and Moon Pokemons, which I usually just refer them to as, and then we would take Roak and beat the last one, very silly. There we go. Oh, what? It didn't take out the... <clears throat> Time to energize and do it again. There we go. And then we will just take a... There we go. That should be it. Either that or we still have plenty of garch pieces to beat them silly. Really. There we go. It's kind of sad that you only see their names, like the, the, the trainer's names in the bottom. And you only have a split second to see what they were called. While we are talking to them, they don't have their names there. That's sad. I believe that you can face Mother Nature itself. Ah. Mm -hmm. Your Pokemon has such genuine eyes. Does that mean that we can take on Mother Nature because we're genuine? That's nice to know. You can overcome anything when you are with your Pokémon. Yeah. I like the trainers a lot more than the, the brat. <laughs> the jerk, it's I'm apparently allowed to say. According to a Pokémon game that is PG. So that's fine. <clears throat> and there... Blue skies and sunshine. Yeah, we definitely need some of that. That's for sure. Let's jump into it. So let's see here. Oh, wow! Check that sky! That's a great... Oh man, sky, 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 blah, blah. There's going to be a lot of sky jokes, aren't there? Um, this place is great, Skylar. <laughs> I'm glad you like it too. Hello? Did you and your Pokemon get a good enough chance to rest? We were battling our way here! Girl, really? <laughs> really? <laughs> we didn't go down and have a cup of tea. Well, I did. My Pokemon and my character did not have a cup of tea. Hi. Well then, why don't we have a bit of fun? Yay, she's so hyper, happy, positive. That is kind of odd for me. <laughs> Because I'm a very realistic person, and positivity comes with the realism in my mind. Um, not the other way around. So, anyway, never mind. Hold on, do you mean? Of course! Uh, hold on, I haven't had my car, I didn't have my tea! Oh, you know what I'm talking about. Okay, this is very suggestive. Is this an in your window? <laughs> Please just go on, yes. I think we need a fun battle to pick our spirits up, yes indeed. Okay, that's uh, not fine. 
All right, let's do this. Okay, that was a quick cutscene. I guess we're gonna battle her now. Right? Yeah, we're gonna battle her now. Um, no, I will think we will wait with this till next time because we're probably also going to talk to her and maybe have a little side quest for her, who knows. So, I think I will end off this episode rather short. And until next time, guys, take care and have a fantastic day.